I'm Cecilia the Amateur, and we're gonna try some Canadian snacks today. For those of you who don't know, my sister has become like my personal PR person, and I love it because she sends me a lot of goodies. And this time from Canada, she sent me snacks. And I'm a foodie, and I love carbs. So this is gonna be exciting. The first thing I'm gonna try are these cheese cheddar crunchies. They're called cheesies, and they're from Hawkins. And I'm assuming they're gonna taste just like normal Cheetos. And I love the fact that because it's from Canada, there's a lot of French words. And I'm not gonna try to pronounce them. Ooh, it smells like a Cheeto. And it looks like a Cheeto. It tastes just like what we have here in the US, but I like it. Nonetheless, it's a 10 out of 10 for me. Oh, and I have my water bottle here to cleanse my palate. Ah, we have Lay's ketchup. Ooh, that smells a lot like ketchup. If you would have put this in a plate, um, if without smelling it, they they look like beets, like like if it was a beet or a chip covered in beet juice, because of the color. Okay. That is strong. If your kid loves ketchup, you know we all have that ketchup phase growing up. This is it. I feel like I'm eating just straight up ketchup. Sticking with some ketchup, we have Old Dutch ketchup flavored gluten free potato chips. These don't smell so much like ketchup. Okay. This is how it looks. Wow, it's like a beauty guru but with the chip. I'm gonna put them side by side. So this is the old Dutch bag, and this is the Le the Lay's ketchup. You see the difference? This one looks more purple, and this one looks more orangey red. So let's try it. Ooh, did I cleanse my palette? No, I have to cleanse the palette. <sighs> okay. These have like a different seasoning on it besides ketchup. Um, I could barely taste the ketchup on these. These are pretty good. All right, if I had to pick, I will pick these. I like these. I like these. But I also like cheese a lot. But if I had to pick, pick between a ketchup chip, it will be this one. We're gonna move on to these chocolate bars. Real milk chocolate. E. You know what? Fun fact, I'm actually allergic to chocolate, so it's not deadly. The one that gives me the less like problems is dark chocolate. The, the darker the better. Let's see how it looks coming out. So it comes in, oh it's broken. Okay, so it's supposed to be one long bar, but it did break. But I guess you could break them off into pieces. It looks just like a milk chocolate will look like because it's a lot lighter. It smells really, it's, oop, that was easy. I thought it was gonna be a lot more. I thought it was gonna be harder, but it's definitely soft and I made a mess. It smells like, it smells like, I like dark chocolate better. Um, I've gotten to the point where like milk chocolate kind of like doesn't taste as good, but we'll see. Okay. What's it plain chocolate? It looks like it's just plain chocolate. It's fluffy. It's not hard at all. I thought it was gonna be hard, but it's fluffy and just soft. It doesn't have any like crunch to it, and that's honestly kind of disappointing. I kind of like the crunch when it comes to chocolate. 
I don't know. It's <sighs> when you squeeze it, it's like, ooh. See, it, this is very messy. So you do not want your kids eating this in your home. It's a lot of chocolate, huh? Like you cannot eat the whole bar by yourself. Like it's just too fluffy. It's, it doesn't have anything. Like no other flavors but chocolate. My husband says that it tastes like crunch, but without the crunch. <laughs> Do with that information as you will. I've heard of Mars before. I don't know if it's a Canadian chocolate per se. It smells just like that one. This one seems harder. Mm. Wow. Yeah. I've never seen it pass on that one. See, for me, I'm okay with cream filling and things like that, but I ha again, I have to be really craving it. If I had to choose between this one and this one, I would go with Mars, though. Well, the reason why this one tastes like Crunch is because it's from the same brand. Ooh. Okay, this one says Coffee Crisp, and this one's really hard. I feel like it's going to be messy. <laughs> Just one big block. It smells like coffee. Ooh. Mmm, coffee. Okay. This one beats all of them because I love coffee. And I will eat this every morning as an excuse that I'm having my cup of coffee. But I'm having my chocolate coffee. I love this one. <laughs> it's messy, but it tastes good. It has a lot of layers. It has crunch. And the chocolate is not too strong. It's just like a glaze over everything else that's goody. Goodness. So my husband likes it, but he says they wished he, they would have made it a little thinner. It's because it's a really like tough bite. It's and we have small mouths too, but it's definitely like a good a good kick. Like that will definitely wake you up. Okay, I'm not a big fan of like hard candy and all that. Like lately, I have because my coworkers are snacking on a lot of candy lately and I'm, I'm being a candy girly and I never really was growing up because I didn't like that I will get stuck on my teeth or get my hands sticky I never really liked that like right now but next we have these they're called Smarties they're not they don't look like the Smarties I grew up eating uh, I don't smell anything but it's a hard candy or is it like... I don't know. I don't know. They look like M&M's. These are some of them. They come in different colors, but the ones that came out are these. But there's definitely some pink ones and orange ones and yellow ones in here as well. There you go. Orange one. <laughs> Maybe you're supposed to... They're like M&M's. It has chocolate? It has chocolate. It says 100% natural colors. Sure. Nothing is 100% natural. Oh, I see it now. Candy coated milk chocolate. Last but not least, we have some maple biscuits. Maple leaf biscuits. Cookies. And judging by the box, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it looks like it's, um, they're heavy, by the way. It, it looks like there's a filling on it. My husband and I both love cookies. We eat them with milk, coffee. That's strong. That's a strong smell. Maple. Maple filling. That's strong. That is strong. <laughs> this is how they look. They're big. Okay. I'm kind of mad that the filling is not all in because that looks like I will have to take a bigger bite. Okay, just to taste it. So, okay.
the cookie is really good like the outside part I like it a lot but I haven't really tried the filling the outside is like a gingerbread but like I don't know <laughs> this is how I find that I have COVID it doesn't really taste like anything I don't know if it's me or if I already like messed up my palette but the inside doesn't taste like anything to me <laughs> there's no taste to the outside of uh, the inside but the outside it's like a normal cookie I learned that milk chocolate is definitely not my favorite even though I shouldn't be eating any chocolate but milk chocolate ew and coffee yes ketchup plays no and whatever these are yes because these have like another spice to it that tastes better let me know if you guys have tried these and let me know which one is your favorite let me know if my sister should send me more things that i should try for you guys okay can you stop it please camera stop I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to become a member of the Amateur Family. And hit the bell to get notified for future videos. And don't forget to comment down below and check out the description box. Thank you again. Bye.